Lane says her love for painting started when she was a little girl, captivated by the magic of her crayons. Now, at the impressive age of 90 years old, mm. that passion still runs strong. Inside her apartment at Heritage at Falmouth, Louise looks back at some of her favorite work. I have to watch. Oh, okay, here's a, a forehead going down to the jaw, which curves around. There's a mouth that's kind of smiling and strange eyes. Well, I see uh, that happens to be one of my favorites. Um, I see a lot of action going on in the forest or under the water, the seaweed and working and, and, um, and the forest. And I hope that it's all well balanced. To me, you have to have the confidence of being able to be an abstract painter, which I hope I am. And you, you just, uh, I guess, as I had said before, you put one color down, a favorite color probably, and then you kept, keep building and building and, and watch your edges. <laughs> There's nothing in particular. It doesn't remind me of just a lot of color that makes me happy. And, um, and it forms together, and I, I like it. But I really like this one, this green one, because it reminds me of underwater and swimming underwater. And um, I could see other things too, but that's the main thing for the green one. I was painting outdoors one day with a group of people, and I don't even remember who they all were or why, but I was there and I happened to notice a man who was painting a little much differently. The same scenery, but his was so much more alive and more color. So I had to walk over there and interrupt him and ask him about his paintings. And he said that he painted and was a student of, of Sam Feinstein who is the, the beginning of all of my painting. This is um, grass poking its head up and uh, sky and flowers and things like that. <laughs> to me, that's what it is. And, um, and I like that one. It's, it seems very abstract to me, more so than some of the others this one and it's just that I like the color and the forms and it looks happy I guess that's why <laughs> I'm in a different world <laughs> I really am I just um, block everything out around me and and that's how all of my friends who paint they do the same thing so we, we're not very chatty when we do this <laughs> you get so involved with what's going on in your mind and in your canvas, and it's just a, a wonderful thing to do. And I miss it. Louise says she's looking forward to start painting again. She has produced about 30 abstract paintings since she started.